bought Hemingway Stadium in Oxford, Mississippi. And now the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Auburn has been waiting all week for this one. Get ready, folks. The opening kickoff is finally here. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. And he's tackled around the 41-yard line. He made a really good move at the line of scrimmage. Sometimes all you need to do is throw off the defender's timing just a little bit at the start of the play. Open field. He gets hit out of bounds at the 45-yard line. He faked out everybody in the stadium. When you can sell the run that well, you're going to have the upper hand on the defense. And they make the stop around the 42-yard line. the option is you're going to have some negative plays, but if you keep running it, it'll create some big play opportunities. Here's third and nine. Ball on the 43-yard line. Looks left, finding his tailback, and down he goes at the 32-yard line. Getting him the ball in the passing game creates real havoc for the defense. There aren't many linebackers who can stay with him in coverage, that's for sure. He's at the 20. He's taken down at the 14. Six-yard line. That's good for a game of eight yards. That brings in second and nine. He's tackled around the three-yard line. We're at play number nine of this current drive. They're trying to stop the run here with a goal line defense. They'll bring him down at the one-yard line. Gain of three on the play. That brings him second and goal. Mike 17, Mike 17. Check, check. Disco Raver. Disco Raver. Touchdown, Mississippi. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A 10-play, 75-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. So our score, 7-0. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Auburn's coaching staff so confident they know they've got a guy that's one of the best running backs in the country and that they can just play their game and not worry about the fact they're on the road. Well, Brett, his big playability not only can give you big chunks of yards on the road, but more importantly, it can quiet this atmosphere and allow the quarterback in this offense to just getting back and, and just being able to run and be able to communicate. And I think that's a big challenge for this team. So look for his big playability to maybe even out the atmosphere and give this offense a chance to be able to execute. taken down right around the 48 yard line i like how efficient the offense looked on that play everybody knew their assignment and it all came together for a nice run
Throws it in a hurry. Knocked out of bounds. Around the 32-yard line. Yeah, the defense looks a little sluggish there. They can do better than that. Somebody jumped early down there. False start. Sometimes what happens on a false start is a lineman will see movement on the other side of the ball and be coaxed into jumping early. It's second and 11. Ball on the 18. The halfback with a carry. Excellent open field tackle. And that'll be a gain of 10 by the running back. Tackle made at the 7. That makes it first and goal. by this defense. The offensive line is so concerned with their penetrating abilities that these linebackers are able to roam free and make plays like that. And this is the 10th play of the drive. Touchdown, Tigers. to get into the end zone. He's a pretty sure bet to get six when you're this close to the end zone. The extra point to tie this game up. And he tacks on the extra point. So a 10-play, 80-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Boy, this offense right now is just being physical, really controlling the line of scrimmage, and it's opening up some nice big lanes for the running backs. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Every drive is important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. Up the middle for a nice game. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. Super job here by the defense of filling the gaps on the line. If you keep stringing out plays like that, you can really shut an option attack down. From their own 28-yard line, third down. Fires it out. He made the catch, but he didn't get the first down. Yeah, right now, the way this defense is swarming, there's just no room for him to get upfield for the first down. Campbell is the putter. He's tackled at the 36. We played one. We're even at seven in this one. Welcome back to the action. Just about set to start quarter number two, and we're all tied up. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum, so as we get closer to halftime, I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. He fights forward to about the 39. That makes it second and six. Hey, 
Caught with room to work. Good tackle. He was the last line of defense. That's a good First down. Get down, get down. Oklahoma. Gets out to around the 15. That makes it second and two. They get nice yardage on that run. That makes it first and goal. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Now we'll see how the backup can do after that injury. And now he's got room to run. Touchdown, Auburn! converts the extra point. The Tigers saw one of their top players going down earlier, but looks like he's going to be able to get back in there. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Throws it away. From their own 25-yard line. It's second down. On the ground with the tailback. You keep gaining negative yards, and you put yourself in a position of having to make bigger and bigger plays. Puts a lot of pressure on that quarterback. Catches it and hit immediately for a loss. Nothing doing for the offense, and it's fourth down. That brings us fourth and 15. Lewis awaiting the return. He's at midfield. He makes it on to maybe the 49-yard line. Not great, but not bad either. As long as your main priorities are not turning the ball over and establishing solid field position, then you're headed in the right direction. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Gains his way to the 43-yard line. Auburn up seven points. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That makes it first and ten. Fires quickly and he's got his man. He's pushed out of bounds at the 31. That'll make it second and four. There's a strike complete, and he's tackled at the 28-yard line. Got a man, watch out here, and he is drilled at the 25-yard line. That's good for a game of three yards. First 
Can't hang on. Incomplete. There's a flag on the field, and I think I have a good feeling of what this might be. Holding offense. Little stumbles like these can Still kill your game. offensive progress. It's first down and a lot. Hey, let's get that ball, Dino. Let's get that ball right here. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Hey. Hey. Under heavy pressure, he gets sacked on the play. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush because sacks can be real drive killers. is up a score. They bring the quarterback down. Great play by the defense. Ooh, that time they came with the blitz and the linebacker was able to get free and come away with the sack. Here's the eighth play of the series. I know the defense would have liked to have prevented such a big game, but the important thing is that they held and brought up fourth down. So the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. Auburn can make this a two-possession game with this field goal. Gets it up, and he got it. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. It. He's in space. The Rebels will use their first time out of the half. The pass good for maybe seven yards. That's a good completion. They didn't get the first down, but they picked up about seven yards. He scrambled. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. And they make the stop at around the 50. A good quarterback knows when and how to improvise. And if he's got the skills, he can also turn a scramble into something big. Well, after that injury, we'll get to see the backup quarterback here. He sails it long. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. Boy, this is a great play by the safety to be able to be in a position to make this play. But he's got to be able to hold on to the football. You know, he's a big, physical, athletic guy but you've got to be able to secure a football and make a big play when it presents itself. Short over the middle. And down he goes at the 49. That play was going nowhere. Yeah, give a lot of credit to the defense here, recognizing pass and swarming to the receiver. So we'll probably get one last heave to the end zone here before halftime. He airs it out. Can't haul it in. We've played a half. Auburn in front, 17-7. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. Both of these defenses are opportunistic and very good at forcing turnovers. But both quarterbacks, David, have done a very good job while trying to maintain an aggressive mindset. They haven't forced the ball. The runners have done a good job keeping it put away. Yeah, and as much as you preach that all throughout the week, it's still hard to do. It's hard to execute, and 
being able to see what you see on the defensive side of the football and adjust to it offensively. How about protecting the quarterback so he's not getting hit from the blind side, fumbling the football, ball carriers running with the football, keeping it tight to their body, not giving it away. So, you know, between running backs, receivers, and quarterbacks, offensive linemen blocking, did a great job executing on the offensive side of the football, not to, create, not to give away any turnovers. That's going to do it for David and me here in the studio. Time to get you back to the game. Red and Kirk ready to take you home in the second half. Welcome back, everybody. Second half action about to begin. He'll return it from the three. And he makes it out to about the 27-yard line. It's going to be interesting to see how the action shakes out in this series. He's got an opening. Gains his way to midfield. And that was an excellent run there. Yeah, Brad, but it was also great blocking up front by the offensive line to open up the hole. He's taken down around the 48-yard line. the 40 makes it to the 37 that's how we do it that's how we do it they don't want it on this that makes it first and 10 check it Oklahoma shift shift hut hut there's a little bit of happy feet down there on the field let's get the call ball start offense Maybe he got the cadence wrong coming out of the huddle. The coaches have a low threshold for mistakes like that. First and 15 now after the penalty. Halfback's got it on the quick throw, and he tackles him hard at the 42-yard line. Nothing going on that play. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws it. Now he's scrambling. Decides to slide. Throws it deep. And it's caught. Touchdown saving tackle, but it leaves him with a first and goal. That makes it first and goal. Touchdown, Tigers. good vision here by the quarterback and a good understanding of where he was on the field. He didn't need much and he knew he could get it himself. He splits the uprights with the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Auburn's coaching staff will go out tonight, and I think the offensive coordinator should buy the defensive coordinator his meal. Well, the defense has been great. There's no doubt about it. But I just think that the offense that they're facing has just been so conservative, so predictable. It's made it very easy for this defense to have a dominant game. They'll bring him down around the 41-yard line. The offense was pretty successful on that play there. That was a very good passing play to get the ball downfield for a very nice gain and a first down. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 41-yard line. They got him for a loss. 
That's a loss of three yards on the play. That'll make it third and 13. And he's taken down at the 37, and they'll lose a yard there. They really just didn't have any room to work on that play. The defense just suffocated them there. This is a great punt blocking team, and it looks like they're going to try to get to this one. And he makes it out to about the 34 yard line. It's early in this game, so the defense can still have an opportunity to make some adjustments. But if things don't turn around in a hurry, it's really going to start to affect the psyche of that defensive line. Runs it right. Nice pickup. That makes it 76. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. That's a game on the play. First down. Roger, Roger. Let's go, Mike. Come on, baby. Come on, let's go. Check, check. Oklahoma. Nice run up the middle. Gaining four yards. That brings him second and five. was well defended by this defense. The offensive line is so concerned with their penetrating abilities that these linebackers are able to roam free and make plays like that. They're down, and they need to get it inside the 44. Now he tries to buy some time. He's wrapped up for the sack. That makes it so Clark to punt. He punts it away, and it's a great kick. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. You know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. their own 20-yard line. Second down. And he hits him hard at the 32. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. It's second and ten. Ball on the 32. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. That's a deep four. That'll bring up 36. Mike five. Mike five. Going right to his tailback. Knocked out of bounds, right around the 42-yard line. Complete, he's got room. Brought down at the 45-yard line. Number six on the top at the 45-yard line. That'll make it second and seven. Run to the outside. They try to get a head start there. Ball start. Offense. It'll be third down again after that penalty. Yeah, now they have more yards Still to pick up for the first down. Third down again. He 
his tackle at the 42. made at the 44-yard line. So with one quarter remaining, Auburn in front, 24-7. Tenth play of the drive. Zips it out to his runner, and he's got him again. That's a great tackle at the 37-yard line and a pickup of about seven. Good decision here. Nice dump off. It's only seven yards, but the offense will take that play every time. Zips it to the tight end. And he's tackled at the 29-yard line. Throws complete. He's got space to work. And he's level at the 25. That's good work. Makes a catch and he's got nowhere to go. with room to work. What a play, and that is first and goal. That was a really nice play on the ball by the receiver for a substantial gain and a first down. And they make the stop at the four-yard line. There's a player hurt. It doesn't look to be that bad. Second down and goal. Ball on the four-yard line. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. This defensive end just showed us why he's much more than just a pass rusher. This is the 17th play of this drive. Fires quickly, and they got it. Touchdown. hits the PAT. A long 17 play, 84 yard drive, and the result, seven points. That was a great hit. He wasn't getting away from that one. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. From the 37-yard line, it's second down. Just over two minutes in the game. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Call it a gain of seven yards. First down. Makes it to the 21. The offensive line got a really good push there, allowing the back to pick up nine on the play. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Well, that's a great job by this offense. The defense knew that the run was coming, and they still could not slow them down. Pick up a first down and allows him to continue to work this clock. Tackled after a decent pickup. Mason gets seven yards on the play. Ole Miss will use their final timeout. He might have a chance. Good outside run there. That makes it first and goal. Blue 14! Blue 14! 
Breaks a tackle and he'll score. Touchdown. That could have been it right there. That score might be the deciding factor in this football game. He makes the PAT. A seven-play, 41-yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. It can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. So the score now, 31-14. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They move the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. Just over a minute in the fourth quarter. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. So they pick up quite a few yards on that play, Kirk. Well, that was an excellent route, and he did a great job of holding on to the football. Spikes the ball. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Slings it quickly to his halfback again. And down he goes around the 37 yard line. This is a this is a Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun, five wide receivers. Wants to go long and does. Incomplete. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 37. And he shoved out of bounds at the 48. Got a man. Watch out here. He goes out of bounds. Right around the 44-yard line. So it's second down and about two yards to go. run and he's brought down that makes it first and ten. Throws complete big loss that brings up second and 13. the spike will stop the clock This is the 10th play of this drive. Four down, four down. 17 Mike, Mike 17. Screen pass. He's got his half back. He's taken down at the 30. Well, they get all those yards, but come up just shy of the first. Good play call. Almost perfect execution, except for the fact that they're not going to get the first down. They'll bring him down at the 11-yard line. That's going to do it for this one. Our final score, 31-14, Tiger. So that wraps things up for us. Three A Sports and Kirk Herbstreit. I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.